Hello, everybody. This is your boy, Drew Jeezy, and I am back. And you guessed it, another Marvel Studios review. As you can see by the thumbnail and the title, I am talking about Rogue from the 1997 anime series X-Men. Before I go any further, I want to see if it's my first time, if anybody's watching this video for the first time, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications, leave me a thumbs up, leave me comments. I really appreciate it. To my current people who are here to subscribe to me, who rock with me since day one, thank you so much. Get that watch time up, run it up. Give me that thumbs up, leave a comment, and share all my videos for new and current subscribers. Share all my videos on whatever platform you have. I really appreciate it. Shout out to my sponsor, Wild Hunter Closing. Shout out to my YouTube brethren, Back Body Mystery. Thank you so much for that. Make sure you run his subscriber account up. Make sure you're trying to get to that monetization. Run it up for me. I really appreciate it. It goes a long way. Now, back to the review. We are talking about the 1997 X-Men anime series figure role. As you guys know, little Brown on a rogue. Rogue was a character who was absorbed your energy. I think she read it to Captain Marvel out of the blue one day, absorbed the energy so much that she actually took her power of flight and super strength. And that's why she has the white hair at the top, because I think she took so much power of her. She put her into a coma for I don't know how many years. And then she finally came out of it. By that time, Rogue had the power to absorb your energy and use your powers as well so she absorbed captain marvel's power to a point where she kept them permanently now when she does absorb people's energy it's only for a short period of time but nonetheless you guys know rogue is actually with one of the other x-men gambit one of my favorite x-men top three so of course they always did it gambit always had a thing for rogue because you know it's something he couldn't have because he couldn't touch it like that but if he did should he go his powers he'll pass out blah 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 so you know I, you know, shout out to Rogue. Rogue is actually pretty cool as well. She's also one of my uh, girlfriend's current uh, favorite X Men outside of Phoenix, aka G Gray. Um, but uh, as you can see, the 1997 animated picture here it looks just like her for the animated series. As you can see, everybody's at the top. And of course, you got Rogue here in her yellow and green with that jacket. Oh, Rogue is sick. I love this thing. Um, so, real quick, you guys, if you're wondering why I have, I'm not going to open this, because the packaging. Oh, and this is so nice. I just don't want to ruin it. I do not want to ruin it. I just don't. So I won't. As you can see, it is a real figure. I got a UPC, Marvel has Studios. Shout out to Big Bad Toys for giving me all these figures. And I'm sorry, wrong sponsor. Shout out to GameStop for getting me all these figures. They had them in the store and I was able to get them. Hopefully I get an ambassador, you know, partnership with GameStop soon. I can, you know, you know, get some get some parts for you guys. Um, as you guys also know that I have five out of the six. So if you guys have been watching all my reviews. You guys know I've already done Bishop, Gambit, and Storm. So I'm doing Rogue now. So that's four out of the six. So it's only two left. So leave a comment. Let me know who you think I don't have, who you think I do have. And, you know, if you know, and let me know. So, you know, I can say if you're right, you're right, you're wrong, you're wrong. You know what I'm saying? But nonetheless, uh, this is the 1997 X-Men Rogue figure. Um, I'm hoping everything on her works correctly. If not, I never take her out, so I will never know. She does have another pair of hands. A uh, hand with no glove and then a closed fist here. I'm gonna put a roll back on this turntable real quick, like so. Bam. So that's pretty much it for this review, you guys. That's pretty much all I got. Once again, I'm not opening up my figures. I know other YouTubers who have opened up theirs. Um, and I'm assuming they probably have two characters, and that's probably why they opened up one that got one sealed. Me, Drew Jeezy, ain't happening. I ain't doing it. I'm gonna keep my ones and let it go from there. Uh, check out the other 1997 expert reviews that I have, as well as everybody else's reviews, man. Check everybody out. Run the numbers up for all of us YouTubers, man. Run them up. You guys would greatly appreciate it. Once again, if this is your first time watching this video, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell for post notifications, leave me a thumbs up, leave me a comment. To my current subscriber, thank you so much for the support. Hit that thumbs up and share, 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 share. Run up through shares. I greatly appreciate it. Shout out to my uh, sponsor. 100 closing shout out to my youtube brethren back by the mysteries run up the subscribers again i cannot sit out enough you guys run up the subscribe account for him i really appreciate it and share his stuff as well as mine he do shorts and reels like i do so run it um shout out to all my youtube inspirations tall guy car view this organic life of Corey, i'm in the hellcat and of course the young 32s another shout out to stunner reese swerbo two times um that's pretty much it for this video you guys that's all i got y'all know i'm out of here i'm about to do it like i always do this is your boy, Drew Jeezy. Competition is always easy. You guys be safe. You guys be blessed. The next time, you guys, I am out.